Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. In this video we are going to solve this interesting university exam. We need to solve this for a and b. a and b are natural. So 2 to the power a minus 2 to the power b equal to 2016. And how can you solve this interesting question? I want to show you the best approach how, how I solve this kind of question. So firstly we write a really interesting case. Right here we have a positive value on the right. So 2 to the power a is greater than 2 to the power b. So this one is greater than this because right here we have positive answer. So this is the basic of mathematics. I hope you understand it. So A is greater than B. Right here positive answer. This element is greater than this one. So A is greater than B. What are we going to do next? Take a look. We need to factor out. Let's, let's factor out 2 to the power B. So firstly, 2 to the power B, let's factor out 2 to the power B in parentheses. 2 to the power A minus B and minus 1, because we factor in 2 to the power b, all whole numbers, equal to 2016. So, take a look. Right here it's really good to write a substitution. So a minus b. a minus b will be equal, for example, to t. It will be better to, to work with it, equal to t. And we'll have our, our expression 2 to the power b, using this substitution, times 2 to the power t, minus 1 equal to 2016. So I hope you understand this step, just factoring 2 to the power b. So right now we need to analyze a little bit this expression, because on the right hand side we have even number. So it's really good to, to know about this, a really good even number, because right here we will have 6, so this number is even. I hope you understand it. And moreover 2 to the power b is even number as well, because doesn't matter about the power 3, 10, 11, 12, we will have even number, because this is like 2 times 2 times 2, and doesn't matter how many 2's we will have, we will have even, even number in the end. But right here we will have 2 to the power t, which is even number, and we, if we subtract 1, we will have odd number. This is the rule. If we have, for example, 2 cube, 2 cube 8 minus 1, 7, 2 to the fourth power, 16 minus 1, 15, so this is this is odd number. So as you can see, it's 2016 right here expressed as even number times odd number. So let's write this 2016 and we'll see how how can we express this 2016. If we divided this 2016 by 2, we will have 1008. Nothing hard, just dividing by 2. Dividing by 2, 504. Dividing by 2, 252. And dividing by 2, 126. Dividing by 2, 63. So as you can see, all of these numbers, all of these, this one, this one, is even numbers. So even. But the last one is odd number. So it's really good to express this 2016 using this odd number. So 2016 we can express as this 63 times 2 to the power 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 times 2 to the fifth power. So let's write this. Let's change this 2016 by this expression. So we will have 2 to the power b, 2 to the power b times 2 to the power t minus 1 equal to 2016. It will be 2 to the fifth power times 63. This is the same. This is the same 2016, but I write it in another way, time, as even number times odd number. So I hope you understand this step. Just firstly factoring and secondly expressing this as even times odd. And take a look. This is a really good view because right here we have 2 and right here we have 2 as well. So it's not hard to see that b will be equal to 5, because this is the same element, this one and this one. So from here, b equal to 5. And moreover, right here is this is odd number. And this is odd number that we find, that we found. So this element and this element, we need to write an equality sign and we need to, we need to solve this. Solve this equation. So 2 to the power t minus 1, 2 to the power t minus 1 will be equal to 63. From here, let's let's separate it. Let's write this one as 2 to the power t equal to 64. 
and as you can see we know that 64 equal to 2 to the power t equal to 2 to the 6th power and from here it's really good so this is 2 to the 6th power I hope you understand this step and from here t equal to 6 this is a classic exponential equation to t equal to t equal to 6 but we don't know t we don't need t because we need a and b b we, we know that equal to 5 but t we have a substitution a minus b equal to t so a minus b equal to t we find b 5 and we find t 6 so a minus minus 5 equal to t 6 so how can you solve it of course or bringing this on the right hand side or just think about it and it will be 11 because 11 minus 5 will be 6 so a equal to 11 and this will be our will be our answer so as you can see a equal to 11 and b equal to b equal to 5 this is our pairs of of solution of course you can check it real quick because I'm interested in this it will be correct or not this is natural this is good that we find so let's check this let's check these roots firstly 2 to the power a so 2 to the power 11 minus 2 to the power 5 what we'll have we'll know that 2 to the 10th power equal to 1024 so I write it as 1024 but we we need to multiply by once more too because right here we have 2 to the 11th power and minus 32 so right here 2048 so 2048 minus 32 minus 32 we will have 6 1 2 0 which is good because we we find it so really good really good question I really like this this kind of question because it's not about a really hard formula it's not about a higher mathematics this is just I want to say chilling chilling uh, chilling algebra problem factoring 2 to the power b expressing as even and odd I hope you understand this step this is the main step that you need to understand to solve this kind of question even odd numbers and expressing this dividing by 2 by 3 sometimes so I hope you understand this this algebra problem so if you don't understand write a question in a comment it will be really interesting to read it if you understand if you enjoyed this video put thumbs up it will it will really help for me for for my channel so thank you so much for watching subscribing putting thumbs up i really appreciate it and thank you so much for watching see you in the next videos